cotton blanket coming up. This is gorgeous. Um, we have it available for you in a few different sizes and colors, but take a look because there's the twin, full, queen, and king with a 500 thread count blanket. It has what we call this cloud stitch that not only is a complete function, yes, because it keeps all of the fluff boxes <laughs> in place, but it also is a beautiful design detail. So here are our color choices. We have it available for you in the blue, gray. We also have a pink, which is almost like a pink Himalayan sea salt in the pink. And then here is gonna be your taupe. Oh, it is such a gorgeous kind of luxe taupe color. Next to that is gonna be your white. And that's gonna be the last color choice. So five different colors to choose from. I have the gray here on our bed and you can just see how polished, how beautiful, how refined this is as that perfect kind of mid-weight blanket. Whether you want something where you sleep a little warmer, colder, this is that right in between from Home Reflections. It's a 500 thread count cloud stitch blanket. The twin starts at 47.46. We have it available for you in the full, which normally would be $77. We're at $56. How about the queen? Instead of spending $88, you're at 63, or let's celebrate those king bed owners because instead of $99, you're saving almost $30 at $71.21. So Amy Scaglioni is bringing us home tonight with this amazing blanket. Amy, you know, I love being able to make over my bed because when I think about a place that should truly be that restful, rejuvenating retreat, it's our bed and Home Reflections makes it possible. Yeah, I couldn't agree more. And I think too, Allie, in this case, we just had our little pillows here. So I'm gonna move those aside. Um, and I have it folded at the foot of my bed with our home reflections sheets. But this is one that's on my bed all the time. I call this the little black dress of blankets. It's right. almost like if you took a blanket, right? And a comforter and you put them together. Yeah. This is one that is great top of bed. I have this on the bed in the summer, spring, summer, winter, fall. If I have a duvet cover, what I do when I want to change things up is I pop pop this right inside of my duvet cover so it can oh, function nice. in a ton of ways. But what we're seeing there is that cloud stitch. So instead of doing a box stitch, we did it in what looks like almost like a puzzle piece or a little cloud. Mm -hmm. When you wash this, it actually puffs up a bit. So it has a softness. And this is what we call warmth without weight. So ah. it feels great on the body. It's not too heavy, but it provides a little layer of warmth. Mm -hmm. When you wash it, it comes out of the dryer beautifully. I have this in a pale pink and a white. I've washed and dried them dozens of times. The finish is beautiful too, Allie. If you notice the finer details with the stitching, mm -hmm. how it's finished, everything's done beautifully. So this is that one that you're gonna pull out and you're gonna use again and again. Maybe we have pieces like fun, colorful sheets or fun, colorful, um, comforters that we pull out and they're fun, yeah. but then we change up the room and we're kind of stuck with them. This right. is going to work with everything. Well, our bed is the biggest piece of real estate in our room. If you want to refresh, but you're saying, oh, I can't quite get a new bed, right? Because I invested in that. I did too. I wouldn't mind getting a new one, but we spent kind of a pretty penny on our first and our style had changed. But what you it can does. do is then change what's on top of the bed, right? That makes That's it really it. easy. And if, if you're saying, well, I can't quite paint the room because maybe I rent or I can't get all new furniture. What about a beautiful top of the bed blanket, right? This is just as Amy yeah. described so beautifully, like in between the blanket, the comforter kind of becoming one. It's not too heavy. It's just the right weight. Make your choice in the size and the color. Now, maybe you'd say, I just would love to have this as like a kind of an accent blanket, you know, fold it at the edge of the bed. So when I take a nap, I have something that I could pull up. Maybe you're just going to get a full size blanket or it's going to be upstairs in the movie room with the kids. And this is going to be that extra blanket you can snuggle up on the couch with the family in, you know, because if popcorn or something gets on, you throw it in the wash, right? So you could get it like a full or queen size if you'd like it to be, you know, like a sofa blanket. But I would That's love for you to idea. put this on the top of the bed, Amy, just because of that, you know, incredible cotton fabric you're getting, but really the full refresh that it does. 100% cotton and it's a 500 thread count. And that's important because you can have 100% cotton in a blanket, 
and it's a very low thread count. And then when you wash it and you dry it and it gets a little use, it'll get a little ratty. Right. This is that perfect thread count because it's a high enough thread count that it provides you with a little bit of weight, but it's not so low that it ends up not holding up well for you. So this is that perfect in between. I think it's going to be one of those that you. I'm comfortable, Amy. Don't mind. Yeah, it's going to be one of those <laughs> that you buy because again, and I keep going back to this because I use it in my everyday life, and I've had this a long time, and I yeah. have two of them because I find I pull it out again and again each season, and again, is it in that duvet cover because. You bought something new, you wanna try it out, but you still want the weight and comfort inside, go ahead and pop it in there. Is it top of bed? Because you wanna play with pattern and color and some different ideas. You wanna right. add in stripe, you wanna add in floral or, or, or eye cat like we showed a little bit earlier. Yeah. You can add all that in without competing with what's on the bed. So it does become a nice staple across yeah, the, uh, it gives that texture without competing another print That's or it. pattern. I'll show you the colors in just a second. But I also think, too, if you're someone that, like, doesn't always love to sleep with a top sheet because it gets tangled maybe underneath you, mm. right? And it just becomes, like, this other thing that you feel like you have to fuss with. Now, I like top sheets, and I actually like to sleep with a lot of blankets, a lot of blankets. I sleep with, like, three. It's weird, I know. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, it's all right. I, Whatever well, works. I like the weight. I sleep with the, you know, the sheet and the down comforter and I put another blanket on top and then I usually sleep in like a barefoot dream sweater. <laughs> I like to be cozy. But here's I'm the thing. I'm always hot, Allie. <laughs> I know. That's even if like that's I'll, honestly, I'll that's even in, sheet, in the that's summer. It. <laughs> <laughs> Um, but here's what I like about this, Amy. For those of us, whether we want this to be an additional layer on our bed or this might be the only layer, it's machine washable too. So yeah. you can take care of it at home. You know, a lot of the times we sleep with the sheet between the big fluffy blanket because I can't wash the blanket every, you know, three, four nights in my washing machine or once a week. You know, I got to go to a laundromat to do that because it's too big. This is one that you can handle at home. It's $47.46 starting at that twin size um, all the way up. So are you refreshing? Is this to send off to a, with a college student, right? For their apartment, their dorm. Here's the colors to choose from. We've got blue. That's a really pretty blue. Now the gray is what I have here in the studio. That's probably one of my faves. I love just kind of that neutral, modern color. Then we also have it available for you in the soft blush pink. Oh my gosh, if my daughter Violet saw that, she'd be <laughs> all over that blanket. Aww. And then I have next, that one, Violet. <laughs> yeah, right? She's jealous. And then next to that, we have a really elegant taupe. And then we have the white as well. Gray has been the most popular as well, um, but a really nice neutral. I just, I can't think of a better way, Amy, to kind of refresh the top of the bed yeah. for the season. And a, it's such simple. a versatile piece. Versatile. And Allie, if you get a moment, could you put this between your hands and just, we, if you sort of do this motion with yeah, it, yeah. notice how nice that fill is, how it slides. Silky. It almost has, yes, silky. And I don't want to use the word gel-like, but it has a smooth right. slickness smooth. to it. So it's going to move across the body well, too. It doesn't have a dry hand. Mm. It feels really, really nice. I, I just think of, you know, it'll be a great foundation Ooh, piece for you. This was not a good from. idea. <laughs> oh man, can I get a cup of tea? <laughs> Here, can I share somebody something? Help this girl. Right? Yeah, somebody help a girl out. No. Um, can I share something with you too, Amy? Because, and I know Please, you, you feel this as somebody who I know you practice like yoga and taking care of yourself is really important. And I when I think about like when I go to sleep, that's where I recharge, I refresh. Our bodies kind of rejuvenate, right? Why not create a space that is so welcoming, right? So that important. really brings us into that place. We surround ourselves with beautiful fabrics, with pieces where we can get a good night's sleep. And even if you're not asleep the whole time, at least you're comfortable. At least you're treating your body to surrounding yourself in 500 thread count cotton, right? In a, in a peaceful, a luxe design, right? I, I want you to think about creating your bedroom and your bed as truly like this retreat center. And what I love about Home Reflections is you don't have to have like hundreds and hundreds of dollars to make it happen, to get that right. like That's, clean, peaceful look. This starts at 50 bucks, Amy. It, it, you shouldn't have to. And also it just takes a little bit of creativity. If you see something on Pinterest or in a magazine, and, and look a little closer. Oh, is that layered? Oh, I see what they did. They folded the sheet back over and then they rolled it and they tucked it. Sometimes it's just getting a little bit 
creative, yeah. but you're going to find it always starts with foundation pieces and then you build from there. It's fun to play with color and pattern, but it's a mm -hmm. building block for yeah. you. Um, and to your point, it's great if it's a building block. It's great if it's colorful and fun. If it's not comfortable and if it doesn't feel good, kinda who cares, right? This is 100% cotton. It's machine washable. It's machine dryable. I always recommend a clean, like either a new tennis ball or you can even ball, uh, buy a, a version of that in the stores. Yeah, like I the wool I always put balls. that in the dryer. Yep, just to fluff yeah. it up. Exactly. This is such a great refresh and it's a functional piece in your home. Don't put up the guest bed with the old comforter that, you know, the kids had in college that now ended up back home that you're still kind of keeping in rotation and you're like, wait a second, how old is this thing? Move that along. And when you make the guest bed for your company, make it with some of the best from Home Reflections. This would be a beautiful top of the bed for your guest bed. In our house, we don't have like a truly dedicated guest room. We use like a really nice air mattress from here at QVC. Um, and so our guests still get a lovely experience because I put beautiful linens on the bed. That's it. Like Home Reflections, 500 thread count, cotton cloud stitch blanket is what we have right here. We have it in twin, full, queen, and king. Depending, and king. <laughs> on, depending on what size, Amy, you're saving like 20 to $30 to pick it up today. So let's go through the colors. And I want to okay, go through great. them a little like slowly, Amy, and I'd love your input on which sure. color is great for our like home style. So here's the blue. Well, blue, I mean, you can't miss. When you pull the average person in America, what is my favorite color? It typically is blue. Blue is restful, blue is spa-like, and it typically invokes a feeling of restfulness. Blue is beautiful with yellows. It would be gorgeous with the pink that you have on the bed. This is easy. Blue is just a simple color to work with. It's beautiful. Then we head into this beautiful. gray, most popular today. Can go a little bit more modern, can go a little bit more contemporary. So this works across the board, but if you're looking for a color to, um, to layer in, I would say gray is gonna be contemporary. And I just mentioned those pink sheets. Pink and gray oh are so gosh. beautiful together. That looks beautiful. And the pink is such the sophisticated hint of blush, almost like a ballet slipper pink. Ballet slipper pink is a perfect description. It's just a whisper of pink. So you're not married to anything too bright or too saturated. I personally have had this on my bed in a guest room and I do it just with white. I love that crisp look, mm. but it's just like if you add a, a whisper or a wash of pink, that means that there's a number of colors that you can work this back to. And because it's just a cloud stitch, it's not a big loud stitch. You can do any pattern, stripe, uh, you know, uh, polka dot, anything that speaks to you, you can work yeah. back to these because it's just the stitching, uh, very easy to work with. It's a foundation piece. And then we also have this taupe. Oh my gosh, to me the taupe, you, it is like so like elegant. Yes, pop the champagne. It's beautiful. Ex yeah, because it doesn't, khaki can get a little orange or a little um, just uh, almost too rich and saturated in mm -hmm. color. This is a soft, beautiful color, easy to work with. Any of these are gonna work when you get them home. It's just a matter of what colors you enjoy working with right. and then getting creative. Uh, and working up from the foundation up. The white, I think, is nice, Amy, because a lot Classic. of home decor we're seeing right now is bringing back like dark paint colors, right? So one of my right. best so, friends, so she classic. just she just bought a house and they painted their bedroom black. I mean, it was like one accent yeah. wall, but oh my gosh, it looks so cool, right? So when you yep. go for the dark colors on the walls, having the light, like a white, um, is really fresh too. Or if you're layering it, Allie, maybe it's yeah. going to be, maybe you do have a beautiful bedspread that you love. And in the winter months, it's going to be sheets, cloud stitch, then a bedspread. So it can mm -hmm. become a layering piece or a standalone. This is extremely luxurious. Your 500 thread count. It feels crisp. It feels good against your skin. That silky feel starting at just $47.46, which is perfect for me, Amy, because I'll, I'll need three or four to layer. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. You need I am, to get all the colors. And I know. I'm probably the like the <laughs> only person in the world that likes to sleep like that with a bunch of layers My best friend. and the big like. I think, it, I think it's the curly hair. She has your hair too. Maybe, like to maybe sleep we under all 500 sleep blanket. cold. I don't know. <laughs> all right. Um, take advantage. We've got twin, full, queen, and king in our cloud stitch blanket from